My roommate horror story is um, when I lived with my ex, we lived in a house with a bunch of people and nobody ever did their dishes, ever. And so shit would get like clogged up and then the water would rise in the sink and it's like gross, dirty dish water. Not good. Them telling me that they were going to do the dishes and then a week later they still weren't done and it was like all moldy and stuff. They clogged the sink in the communal kitchen but continued to use the sink until it was just black, murky water that was overflowing. Oh, that's the funny one. Uh, got angry, threw a towel against the wall, uh, didn't speak to me. He sleeps in his underwear too. So uh, sometimes in the, in the middle of the night, or in the morning when I wake up, I see like a butt crack or something. The worst thing that my roommate did for about three weeks was set up her alarm at 6 a.m., eh, 6 a.m., 6.15, 6.20, and so on, and she would let the uh, the phone ring till it would turn off by itself. Having different living habits. Like, we generally get along really well, but I'd say just like, everybody has different living habits and like different definitions of clean. We forgot to take like, I think it was six Aussie box containers to the J, so you know they could get cleaned up again and reused. Um, so we forgot about that, and <coughs> they stayed there over break, so for a month. And when we came back, uh, we came a week early before school started. Um, yeah, we came to some fun guy. <laughs> Definitely the one thing of just not picking up after themselves and doing dishes and kind of being respectful of the larger living room spaces or kitchen spaces.